Somewhere over the Aleutian Islands, an enemy plane is making its way toward mainland Alaska. The airmen working at NORAD spot it on the radar and training exercise Vigilant Shield takes off. We need to be prepared for whatever threat uh, comes into NORAD from wherever that comes from. General Ken Wilsbach says the annual exercise is all about procedure. Detect the enemy plane, evaluate the threat and respond. Alaska's size and Arctic terrain can make that response risky. Our jets don't have skis on them like some of the bush pilots do around here and so we have to have a plan. Mid-air refueling is one way to give the jets more flight time as they track down the enemy aircraft. Some of the planes are American, others Canadian. It's not just a question of one country or the other. Uh, it's air forces, it's, uh, it's fighter aircraft, it's tankers. General Patrice LaRoche says learning to speak each other's military language is part of the exercise. To work together, to fly together. Uh, to communicate together to get the mission done is key. Ground forces also get involved, tracking incoming enemy planes and targeting them. This exercise uh, gives us a chance uh, to um, do a specific uh, mission in, in our homelands uh, to protect our homelands, which is um, uh, certainly beneficial and, and rewarding. Wilsbach says this training is similar to the intercept mission the F-22s fly when Russia's planes get too close to our airspace. So if they or anyone else ever cross that line, forces here and in Canada will be ready. Bonnie Bowman, KTVA 11 News.